How's it going guys? I'm your host Carbon Gaming. Welcome back to another Adventure Quest video and in this week's video we will be looking at the latest release in South Adventure Quest and that will be Decorate the Battle on Tree. That's right guys, Frostville is finally around the corner. Okay, but before we do that, I'm going to go through a few other things first. First of all, Holiday Bonus receive up to 25% more bonus Z tokens when you purchase a Z token package. Unfortunately, the Black Friday discount is over so if you missed your chance to get um z token items inside the game for half off then you know you're going to, have to wait again but you know the token uh bonus is still going on so if you guys are looking to buy any z token packages then go ahead and do it now because you can get up to 25 percent more bonus z tokens i don't know if there will be a 50 percent one we haven't seen a 50 percent z token sale in a very long time in fact uh, was there even 50% sale before? I think there was, uh, but that was like quite a while ago. So I don't know if they ever plan on uh, making the 50% Z token sale return. Maybe in the 20th anniversary, when AQ uh, C hits the big, big 20, I don't really know. But if you are really desperate for tokens right now, then you can go ahead and get it for 25% off. Okay, and another thing I want to go through is the donation con- Oh, uh... Limited time shop, there's some extra stuff here. Let's see what we have. Uh, these are not new, right? Four type dagger, only available for October. It's already December now, but it's still here. Okay. Shattered mirror blade. This blade is forged with a broken mirror, but instead of making it unlucky, you can reroute some of that misfortune to your foe. Do bonus damage versus any foes. Ooh, this is interesting. I actually did not realize that this was in the shop. I don't know how long it has been there. I assume it was there since um, the the last Friday the 13th. When was that? Let me check my calendar here. That was like... Oh, it's been here for about a month already. The last Friday the 13th was in November. So I assume that's when it was added. This one, uh, it looks like a reskin of Giant... The giant butcher blade or whatever you call it, I forgot already. The one you get from Golden Gift Boxes that deals off damage, except this does light damage and it triggers against four with greater than zero luck. I think I will actually get this. Uh, why the heck not? Let's buy this item first. Okay, so let's buy that. Shattered Mirror Blade, okay. I probably won't use it as a main, but you know, I like it. Uh, Toronto Saurus Rex, nothing new here. This is nothing new. Spells. Gravy Cannon. Okay, this is token only. Six big hits of water and wind damage with a chance to slow down your enemy with gravy. Nope. Uh, this one is just a regular summon spell with a guest that can seek between darkness and water. Not really worth getting. Uh, Undead Turkey. Oh. Fire or Darkness is stronger than normal due to using multiple elements. Interesting. So it's random. Fire or Earth. Okay, it's all tokens only. I don't think any of these are actually worth getting. So I wouldn't pick them up if I were you. There are better pets inside the game. Maple Wushenka. Okay, you get some nice new helms. Okay, Frostville helms. These are for 10k gold. Uh, not really my type of... Not really the type of helm I will actually go for. So I'm going to pass those up. Now let's go and look at the donation contest. Okay. Top 25 donators for Kibbles. You get the Black Slayer weapons. Top 50 donators. You get the Black Slayer shield. Top 100. You get the color custom. Black Slayer face. And all gold donators. You get the Black Slayer mist. Okay. For Tibbles, Which is for tokens. Okay. You get the Nutcracker weapons. Top 50. You get the Nutcracker shield. Top 100. You get the uh, color custom Nutcracker. Cracker face and all Z token donators, you get the Nutcracker miss. Okay, so let's look at the top donators right now. This one is for Go. Oh, this is for 2019. Guess they haven't updated the one for 2020 yet. Why? Yeah, this is. Uh. I don't know, man. Is this. Wait, why does it say 2019 here? Is this 2020 or 2019? I don't know. But, anyways, uh. 60 billion go already this is quite insane wow this is this is real crazy man this is really really crazy oh my gosh uh let's look at the top token donators these are where the real rich people are <laughs> okay absolute zero uh of course you won't be able to see 0 0.393 million total z tokens that's 
393,000 Z tokens in total already given away. Wow, this is insane. Okay, so you want to play every day for a chance to be able to get the tokens or uh, gold donation from other people. And apparently what somebody told me was that the donations don't happen in real time. So you don't get it right as the person donates it. So uh, it's basically if you have a saved battle every single day basically you just win any battle every single day uh to make sure that you are locked in or to make sure that you're playing for that g day you can enter into this uh pool and then they'll randomly select people from the pool to give you a uh either a token uh donation or a gold donation and it's totally random and you'll probably get it on the first battle of your day or something like that okay but don't quote me on th this thing i'm not I'm not entirely sure on that but I think we will just donate a bit of gold and donate a bit of Z tokens to make sure we get the miscellaneous items so let's go for the tokens one first we have 3791 tokens you just have to donate the minimum amount okay you can track your progress interesting uh, oh this is gold you know actually I don't have a lot of gold <laughs> 100 gold given to IJE. I hope you enjoyed that. I'm not rich. You can see that I have have been pretty lazy. I've not farmed up to the max gold cap yet. I mean, there's really no need to, I guess, until I really need it. But yeah. Uh, how do you track your pro... Wait, no, 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 sorry. How do you track your progress? Actually, it says you can track your progress. Does it tell you how much gold you donate? No, it only shows you the list. Okay. Zero, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a Scrooge. I'm a Scrooge, guys. <laughs> okay, let's donate some tokens. I mean, any token is good. To is a good any amount of tokens is good, right? Doesn't matter even if it's ten or if it's a hundred. Tokens are always useful, even no matter how small the amount. Okay. Uh, minimum amount is twenty five. Let's donate twenty five. Ryan. Okay, Ryan. Hope you enjoy your twenty five Z tokens. Uh, hopefully somebody gives me something nice. I mean, the entirety of the summer contest, I did not get a single donation from anybody. Maybe it's cause I'm a Scrooge and didn't donate anything, but... Uh, come on. Like, I'm sure there are hundreds of other players who didn't donate anything and got something good out of it, right? Okay, so good to see you. Hi, Rabina. What happened to the fountain that was in the town square? You got to remove it due to the frigid weather. Something about pipes freezing and bursting. He said it made the town look empty, so he replaced it with a tree. He has such an eye for these those type of things. Huh, it seems a little plain, doesn't it? I bet with a little hunting, I could really spruce it up. Hunting? I love hunting. I bet some Zap pelts and be behemoth teeth would look really nice. What? Ew, no. I mean, we could look around. I'm sure there's some spare decorations left lying about. Oh yeah, that's a great idea. I'll put together a list for us. This will be so much fun. I love this time of year. Okay, let's hunt. Okay, we'll hunt by ourselves. Uh, let's. Yeah, it's the same thing from every year, but it's uh, diff you get different rewards. Okay, so let's hunt for a star burning bright. Okay, frost berserker. So we have to get into our uh, Terra Blood. No, 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 no. Hand of Terra Soul. Sorry, I always confuse the two. Cause they they both have Terra inside their name. Okay. Uh. <coughs> okay, let's start. Um, fire, right? Okay, we will gain a bit of SP first. Yeah, 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 we are doing fine. We'll gain a bit of SP first and then we will go ahead and do the whole Berserker Nuke thing. Okay, maybe on the second battle, I will go ahead and charge up the SP using my HP. Probably should have done it at uh, the Combat Practice Trainer first, but you know, kind of lazy. Monster goes into a rage. Yeah, okay. Let's just click on that. Make sure they don't hit us. If it's enraged, uh, probably very low chance of hitting us. Yeah, okay. We just got unlucky that. Wow, he hit me through the defense boost. Damn it. Bye to you. Here, no flesh. Ah, oh, this guy. This guy hits hard, right? I think he hits hard. I can't remember. No flesh, no flesh, no flesh, no flesh. All these undead make you want to wretch.
Uh, about 200 plus damage each turn. It's not too bad. We can take him. Uh, that's fine. We should kill him before he kills us, right? I think we will get a full heal after this battle. See, come on. Let's finish it already. Give me my full heal now. Nope. Uh, 100 luck, okay, oh, good thing I saved up, huh, ah, 60 SP, nice, shiny star, okay, some fluff to keep it warm, right, ice snail, uh, armor, let's go for, yeah, I definitely want to save up, I guess, for, save some SP for the roll later on, uh, shoes, chieftain santon, also, I wonder if we'll see the Purple Rain and the Essence Orb nerf by the end of this year, or will they actually put it onto next year? Who knows? I think this should be more than enough to kill him in one hit, right? Uh, unfortunately, no. Ice is 95%. Oh, Jesus. Wow. Yeah, yeah. I should probably play it safer a little bit more. Tree Slugger. Oh, this guy. Okay, let's do Papa Rain. Uh, Buffalot. Shadow Feeder. Nope. Nope. Okay. I think we will do Power Gauntlet first. I think we'll just do time since Shadow Feeder is not exactly very reliable. Uh, let's purple rain. No, come on. Okay. Blood contract and let's attack. And now we will kill him. Okay, easy. <coughs> and we get a full heal. 100 luck Power of Fluff Okay Strings of Light to Shine in the Night Okay, I really like that they let us You know, use the whole celerity thing now The whole uh, SP thing to overcome it now So that I don't have to keep rolling If I get bad luck or anything like that Okay uh, Purple Rain first Definitely buff a lot I think just time and power will be enough. Wait, let me regain back a bit more SP. Okay, good to go. Of course we miss. Of course we did. Ugh. No matter. Easy. Next one. Two bear. Ah, this one is the one with a bit more HP. Uh, I don't know if he will go first. Che, he probably won't, but whatever. Just to be safe. Let's do purple rain. Uh, buff a lot. I think this one will probably need shadow feeder as well. I will not bother with the defense boost because I think he we should probably kill him before he even gets a turn. Uh let's gain a bit more SP just in case. Yep, we will kill him before he gets a turn. That's fine. That's good. Now to finish him off. Alright, goodbye, two bear.
Uh, why do I keep missing by a little bit? Dang. Okay, powerful lights. Now, last but not least, the Ops of Decorating Power. Alright, Piano Flash again. I think this guy can do quite a lot of damage if we don't kill him in one turn. So I want to play it safer. I mean, it's the last one already. I don't want to screw it up. Yep, easy. Last monster, hopefully piano flash again. Okay, let's go. Uh Papa Rain. I want to make sure you get a max SP bar just in case something goes horribly wrong. Okay. Oh wait. Should probably do this first. Okay. Right. Maxed out the SP bar already. Oh, whoops. Oh, whoopsies. Whoopsies, whoopsies. I messed up. Whoops. Clicked on the wrong thing. Uh, that's fine. Shadow feeder. Mm hmm. Uh, that's fine. I messed. I messed up. I misclicked just now, but it's okay. Last one. No, guess we didn't need the SP after. Okay, done. Ops of decorating power. Now a beautiful tree once again. Thank you for hanging out and helping with decorations. It's been an intense year. Now they are finally winding down. It's nice to get to slow down and appreciate the nice little moments. It is. I'm not that. I'm not one for routine, but it does make me feel a little cozy. You keep these little traditions alive, leading up to the big season. Alright then, now that the tree is looking as nice as ever, let's go see Yuga about one mark before we do anything else. It is to being out in the cold for hours, but it really should slow down a little. Maybe the year should slow down, I can't believe it's Frostville already. Yeah guys, I know right, like this year has been... Man, it's been a really fast and uh, uneventful year, I would say. And the reason why it's so fast is probably because there weren't any big events or whatnot um obviously due to the whole covid and coronavirus thingy that's why we don't really have any big events going on and it feels like eh, nothing much has happened this year but you know end of another year 2020 guys uh stay tuned i have more plans definitely for next year but you know i shall not review anything in uh much inside this video stay tuned for future videos i will talk uh, more about this okay i mean that you're looking kind of tired, not just in general, but since you're going there, when is the last time you caught any rest? You blazed the trail back west on your own and everything that followed. Oh, once again linking back to the main story. I like I like that they are linking linking all these stories together. Okay. Aren't you tired? Wait, whoa, what was that? I'm not sure I ever saw you just resting. Actually resting for a few days, that is. Rangers are out there in the wilderness most of the time and you still know to let our heads and muscles recover a little bit. Yeah, resting. Speaking of rest, AQ team. You want us to rest, then stop putting amazing rewards behind long quests. <laughs> Give us amazing rewards behind for doing nothing. Lazy quest style. You know what I mean? Rest. Yeah, the hero can rest. We can rest too. <laughs> Just, okay, uh, jokes aside, I would like to see an interesting Frostville boss this year. We've had quite a bunch of interesting bosses this year. And... Elena actually did uh, ask on her Twitter whether or not uh, she, she asked what, uh, what are our favorite bosses to come to AQ this uh, 2020 so those of you guys who still have an active Twitter account I no longer use my Twitter anymore you guys can go ahead and comment down on uh, Elena's post what are your favorite bosses inside of AQ that they released in 2020 this year the more the more notable ones I can think of are Hexsham uh, Star Slayer, I mean Star Slayer is getting revamped every single year. Uh, you have your Silk Screamer, uh, the Necromancer Ringleader from the end of the Paladin quest line. There is a uh, Doom Binder, of course, and hmm, can't really remember anymore. Yeah, those are the more notable ones for me. Okay. 
There's still a lot of trouble out there, wasting an advantage against the strangers or a chance to make the kingdoms work together could have been terrible and then there's the outlaws organizing to make bigger moves. Come to me, whoa. Alright, I'm stopping you there. I'm not saying you did anything wrong or less than you should have, but thinking about everything how you about everything you could have done is how you justify pushing yourself to a breaking point. So it looks like a foreshadowing of something. What's all that uh, creepy looking text floating above our hero's heads? You are happy that you're helping reclaim my home even if none of us might live to see it restored. I can't begin to tell you how much it means to me personally. It's The point is you're burning the candle at both ends. Alright, I didn't think I was making you worry that much. It's just finally seemed that we'll have a chance to make some permanent progress to end a threat for good. I thought I might save us a terrible war later on. Alright, that does it. Just because you're right doesn't mean you're not missing the point. You're going to go to deflate those bags under your eyes just now. Don't even let me hear the first but. Cyrus and your new North allies have their entire region on watch. Rubab's got the shores covered. With the kingdoms actually having to work together to find any other spooks, the guardians can focus on the south. I can look into the bandit leads just fine, and I dare you to tell me otherwise. You are going to go to a... You are going to go to you guys, have yourself a long sleep and wake up to a nice warm mark on my tab. Close your eyes. When you wake up, we are going to bury you in so much Frostvale cheer that are going to be recovering for years. Now go on, we've got Frostvale in the back. And don't even think of getting up before I come knocking. I was being dead out, going to help me sleep. Yawn. Alright, a few hours won't hurt. Uh huh. Yeah, something definitely isn't right. Is that Welcome Home Dear? The Nightmare Queen. Wow, okay. Nightmare Queen makes another appearance yet again every year during Frostville. Oh god. Coming next week. Welcome home. I see the theme for this year is Nightmare. We have uh Remtalas inside of Dragon Fable, his whole dream thingy, and inside of AQ we have uh the Nightmare Queen, okay. Shock weapons, let's see here. Uh, I don't know what's new and what's not, so I'm going to go through everything, okay. Dream Weavers in sight. Some dreams are. This fire won't leave the dream I okay, can replenish your mana. Ooh, interesting. So you can replenish mana on hit. This one, refreshing. Uh, replenish your SP on hit. Uh, recently, the staff has introduced a lot of SP regenerating weapon and items. I guess this is to prepare us. For the whole essence orb and uh purple rain nerf. Okay, more ways to regain SP apart from just mass clicking on essence orb. So I guess it's kinda nice, but uh I don't know how useful they are. Dream Weaver Scouch. I mean the decorate the battle on tree quest will be here all the way until the end of Frostville. So I think I'm going to hold off on uh buying the items first. Wait, what? What? Guys, the thunder stuff is still here. Wait, what? I thought this was for. Oh, oh wow. Did they? Is it? Was it on purpose? Or am I missing something here? I thought this was the reward for the gift delivery or something like that. Uh. Yeah, am I missing something? Isn't this the reward for gift delivery? Or was it here all along? I, I honestly cannot remember, but... Wow. Okay, guys, go ahead and get it if you haven't already. Uh, especially for rangers. I think it's one of the best uh, energy items to start the game for rangers. So definitely go ahead and get it if you haven't already. Uh, Frostbite. Nope. Okay, so yeah. The new, the new weapons, they just regenerate SP. And for the magic version, MP. So... You guys can go ahead and get that if you want to. But I am not going to get that. So that is going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And of course, be sure to subscribe to this channel. If you'd like to see more such future content. Till the next time, I'm your host, Carbine Gaming. Peace out.